The Prime Minister's announced a social media crackdown which would force the technology companies potentially to hand over encrypted messages by terror suspects. It'll force them if they don't cooperate. We've spoken to the Attorney General this morning. Their first um, port of call is basically they want protocols in place with the likes of Facebook and Apple to uh, decrypt private messages and technology. But if those protocols aren't agreed to and cooperation forthcoming, then legislation will be put in place to force them to do so. I spoke to the attorney a short time ago. It's not good enough, frankly, for anyone to hide behind the fact that there is a new technology that enables these communications to be encrypted, to say, I'm sorry, we're not uh, prepared to cooperate with you. So they want cooperation in the first instance. If not, they'll legislate to demand it uh, in the second and will legislate by the end of this year. The Attorney General says this is not something that everyday users and uh, patrons of these technologies, whether it be Apple iPhones or people on Facebook or WhatsApp, that, then, that everyday people shouldn't worry about it. It is really only cases where intelligence agencies have warrants, just like they've used with traditional telephone communications for many decades. It's got nothing to do with mass surveillance. It is not mass surveillance and it's not going to make um, their everyday um, uh, dealings um, in social media insecure. Um, the fact is that information security is a very high value. It is an economic benefit. It matters to people and the government is determined to protect it.